हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू द वीडियो सीरीज ऑफ उफ्स कॉन्सेप्ट फॉर इंटरव्यू प्रिपरेशन इन प्रीवियस वीडियोस वी हैव डिस्कस्ड द पॉलीमॉर्फिन एंड इंटर इनहेरिटेंस प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ उफ्स इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द इनकैप्सुलेशन प्रॉपर्टी सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट इज इनकैप्सुलेशन एंड आफ्टर दैट वी विल डिस्कस द कॉन्सेप्ट एंड द प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ इनकैप्सुलेशन सो इन इनकैप्सुलेशन रैपिंग ऑफ डाटा मेंबर्स एंड मेंबर फंक्शन इन अ सिंगल यूनिट इज नॉन एज इनकैप्सुलेशन दिस इज द फॉर्मल डेफिनेशन दैट द रैपिंग ऑफ डाटा मेंबर्स एंड मेंबर फंक्शन इन टू अ सिंगल यूनिट इज नॉन एज इनकैप्सुलेशन एंड दैट यूनिट इज नॉन एज क्लास सो वॉट आई मीन इफ वी कैन रैप वी कैन रैप डाटा मेंबर्स एंड मेंबर फंक्शन इन टू अ यूनिट इन टू अ unit or in a bundle so that no one outside of that bundle can change these property so encapsulation means no one can alter these properties so we can explain it with the help of a class so let's uh, define a class so first of all uh, in java or c++ you can define in any programming language let's take example of java class After that, we will take an example of C++ class. Uh, basically, any kind of solution is uh, same for Java as well as C++. So there is a class. Let's say class employee, E M P employee, and it has some uh, like members. So maybe it private or it may be public. So I just just assuming that there is a private or uh, pri private integer. employee id imp id okay after that uh, let's say we have a functions setter and getter so yahan pe uh, let let's define a function set setter and getter so public uh, sorry uh, public void set set id and it pass uh, id so it will be integer id and it will set like this uh, e emp id id and let's say this is like this id equals to id and there is a another function called get id so public void get id Will return or it will uh, print or whatever we want. It will return or we can print the value. So system dot out dot print ID. EID. That means EMP ID. So it will print simply employee ID. And this is the the this class is known as encapsulation. because no one from outside the class can change the employee id because it is a private member so from outside we cannot change private uh, members of a class so uh, actually whenever we call a, we create a object let's say emp e equals to new emp so whenever we write this uh, this line so automatically a block of memory will be reserved for this object this object will be created which has this id and these functions inside it so that means we have created a bundle we have created a bundle or a wrapper of some data members it might be possible that we have a data more than, uh, more than one data member i have uh, only for example i have taken only one that is employee id and more than one function uh, for example i have taken two functions so basically i have uh, wrap these two that means members these are the members and these are the uh, these are the data members and the, these are the member function so i have wrap these uh, data members and member function into single unit and this unit is known as class this unit is known as class so this the, the whole concept is known as encapsulation from outside we cannot change the employee id for example we can set employee id with the set function whenever we call set function inside that class with the help of this object we can set employee id but from outside that means without e without e we cannot change 
this employee id and we, without this object e we cannot get that value that, that means we cannot call uh, void get uh, get id without this object that means encapsulation is a process or it, uh, encapsulation is a way of wrapping data members and member function into a single unit into a single unit or in a wrapper in a bundle so it provides in uh, abstraction uh, no one from outside that class can see what is inside that class so this is the uh, logic of encapsulation and we can also define encapsulation in java as well so let's say that same example for java but uh, there is some difference in uh, inside class so i have taken an example of java now i uh, let take an example of c++ so it may be same and we have to terminate the class like this because this is the extension of structure so it is c++ i am just i am just want to explain for the reference c++ and uh, here a private member like defined like this private after that this uh, operation uh, this uh, uh, symbol after that integer emp id and uh, public member like this public after that we can define void set id set id set id integer id and uh, it will be, uh, the body is like this uh, emp id equals to id and uh, similarly void get id and it will return or see out mp id so basically this is the example of c++ class so the main logic of encapsulation is wrapping data members these are the data members it may be possible that we have more than one data member like employee name employee id employee uh, salary and etc and we have multiple function like setter and getter and other related function for that class so wrapping these data members and these data uh, member function into a single unit single unit means that employee class and whenever we need this whole bundle like whenever we uh, in, the, uh, in C++ plus plus we do not need like this that uh, with the help of new operator we can use new operator as well but before uh, without new operator we can also use like this if we define like employee e so we can access with the help of e these members because this is the extension of a structure so we can also use like uh, as a structure so now we can use these Member, uh, data members and this uh, member function with the help of this e which is the reference variable for the object of that class object of emp class so this is the concept of encapsulation that means wrapping data basically when interviewer asks you what is what do you mean by encapsulation so you should simply say that wrapping of data members and member function into a single unit is known as encapsulation so no one from outside can access or can modify these the properties and after that you can uh, give the example of a class that a class is a perfect example of encapsulation so you can give that example now they will ask about the real life example they will ask about real life example uh, uh, similarly as i already explained you that uh, how polymer uh, they will ask the real life example of polymorphism uh, the real life example of inheritance like parents uh, uh, child get property from parents so they are uh, they are here they may ask that give me a real life example of encapsulation so you can simply uh, for example let's take an example of car so car or let's say uh, take an example of fan whatever you want so you can take an example of car and you can take an example of fan or you can take an example of bicycle or mobile phone whatever you want so car has some properties like properties means it has a model number which is uh, constant or it has some uh, like color so these are the members and it has some function like how to drive acceleration acceleration uh, windows 
एंड एसी एसी इज वर्किंग और नॉट सो दीज आर द फंक्शनलिटी दैट इट हैज सम फंक्शनलिटी इट कैन रीच द स्पीड ऑफ 500 किलोमीटर पर आवर सो दीज आर द फंक्शनलिटी सो कार इज अ क्लास और कार इज अ इनकैप्सुलेट सन ऑफ दीज मेंबर्स एंड मेंबर फंक्शंस और यू कैन सी द फैन सो फैन हैज लाइक कलर द नंबर ऑफ ब्लेड्स these are the data members and it has some functionality like it can move it can move so these are the functionality so you can wrap this functionality to a single unit and this unit is known as fan which is a class so this is the real life example of encapsulation so i hope you got the point and you can explain whenever you are facing the problem uh, whenever you are facing an uh, interview and they will ask you uh, can you tell me something about encapsulation so you can you can explain these kind of thing that first of all with start with definition that encapsulation is a process or wrapping of you can start like this wrapping data members and member function into single unit is known as encapsulation and this single unit is known as class after that they will they may ask about the real life example or you can uh, give the real life example for car and fan or whatever mobile mobile has some features and some functionality so you can say that uh, when we combine these things this class like the, that one car for example uh, if you can uh, say audi audi is a example of encapsulation which has some properties and some functionality so you can explain like this so i hope you will uh, you can explain you now you are able to understand what is encapsulation and what uh, why it is beneficial because no one from outside can modify the properties so if you like the video please do like and don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't forget to download programming solution android app initially it was c programming solution but now i have uploaded all the contents related java c++ and for placement preparation and for your gate preparation in a single app so you can simply download it a small app and you can uh, prepare for your campus placement for off campus placement and for your uh, gate exam as well as uh, any other uh, programming context uh, contest so you can simply get all the information from the single app that is programming solution which is available on google play store if you, if you search programming solution you will get the first uh, android app and if you are uh, facing any travel then i will i will uh, provide the link in description so you can easily download it Thank you for watching.